science should not be quantum physics. It should be the Bible. Yes, it is the Bible. I only got into quantum physics about a year ago. Okay, so yeah, I experienced. So, subs the... right, so substantiate your evidence from scripture. Oh, there's so many Trinitarian verses. I can even prove in the Old Testament. And I'll even, tell you there's none. Even my channel name is, um, who shall I send who will go for us? And I said, here I am, Lord, send me. Even my channel name is a Trinitarian. And you have the royal we as well. What's the royal we? You, you think it's the, they're talking on behalf of? Trying no. To separate. Tell me what the royal we is. Okay, so the royal we is a, is a sem Semitic term, which refers to, which is about where God uses the plural to refer to himself in the singular. Because of his majesty, that's why it's called the plural of majesty. Okay, in the Semitic you tell me I can look into this. So, for example, yeah, so that's fine. So, for example, you can see in uh, Ezra's writings, okay. right? Ezra, when he explains Genesis 1 uh, 126, where he says, Let us make man in our image, he's very, he is very categorical and unequivocal about God using the royal we. Uh, God was uh, uh, in the beginning was the word and words with God, and the word with God. The beginning was the... Uh, no, no, I'm talking about Genesis 126. And the word was God. I know, but I'm no, that's fleshing John 1. it out. Yeah, yeah, but I'm fleshing it out for you. We take no, but you're not... precept upon precept, line upon line. You understand? So I'm ham it's I understand it's that concept. The same in the no, same it's event, not. It? It's not. What event is he describing? Okay, because at the end of the day, um, over here we've got in Genesis 126, it's referring to the creation of mankind. Yes. Right. In in the prologue of John. You're made in plural as well. Do you believe that? Huh? You, are you are you? Look in the Quran. Spirit? In the Quran, Allah speaks in the royal we yes. as well. Okay. Yes. So the concept of the would it be majestic plural. Would, would it not make a simpler thing with the language? Because God is very precise. Even I agree. In the Greek, it's the most precise language I think we have. This is my knowledge. It's uh, very, okay. very precise. Look, I'm not. I, I'm a beginner in the Greek language. I don't need to. I okay. Just, I'm King James. So I can't. Alone. Look. Okay. Look. That's 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 your position. Mm. For me, I examine the, the evidence wherever it leads, okay? Amen. Now, the Greek I'm not learned on, okay? I'm, I'm very basic on my Greek, so I can't comment to how precise the Greek language is in, in terms of what it co communicates. So I'm not gonna get into that. What I'm speaking about is the Semitic languages, right? Because the, if we are talking about the Old Testament and the Quran and being Semitic languages, the, the, the majestic plural is used in both. If I give you my email, you can send me the information, I'll look into it. That's why, not, that's why not a problem. I test everything. That's not a problem. So, that's what it is. So when you're speaking about the majestic plural, it is not referring to a trinity in any sense whatsoever. It is referring to a singular okay. being who is God Almighty. Okay, can you back that up? I know you said now, but yeah, can you sure. tell me where I can look Yeah, sure, it? sure. Like I've already said to you, you look in Ezra, Semitic. this is... So you can look at it in terms of language. Yeah. The Hebrew language, the, the concept of the majestic plural is in, in the Hebrew language. If you look at the commentaries of the rabbis, Ezra being one of them. Yeah. Uh, uh, what's the other one? Uh, Rasha, Rasha, no, 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 not that Ezra. The other, the, the, there's a, oh, there's a rabbi called... No, 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 no. I don't no, no, no. Uh, Jewish rabbis. I discard that. I'm saying it because they reject the Trinity. So I would come No, but we are talking about the language of the, no, the Old Testament. I, I'm, I'm a solar scripture. So even, no, no, to man's even, no, no, so, no, no, no. So even if you're doing solar sub scriptura, words have meanings. Right. So who who is going to be, who's going to interpret those words? Can I tell you one thing? Are you aware that the Hebrew and the Greek language is spoken in three? What do you mean? Okay, so every letter in the Hebrew Oh, you mean the root a words? Number, has a number and it has a picture as well. And in the Greek it happens as well, and in the English it's just numbers. No, no, no. This, this is not something letter. this is not something no, this is the, the nu numerology the Comancho, they call it Comancho. Yeah, numerology I know. Satanic. I, I, think, I think I think I know who you are. I think you came on the stream on the same stream that I was on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, that is something that is not accepted in main, in any sort of um, field of study with regards to the scriptures. Yes. Okay. So okay. The, the, the nothing, rabbis don't have Gamancha in their thing and been studying Gamancha. The the, the the rabbis. No, 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 not not not, main, no, not the mainstream rabbis. I have this uh, I have this um, challenge to Zishan on the perfect preservation of the King James. I know. Bible. I was I was on that. I, no, 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 sorry. I met well, him I, live. And yeah. if any Muslim wants to come up yeah, but the, a live stream... Listen, but Gamantria is not a subject that any Muslim will debate. I know they will, because they know, yes, good. We've got Jeff. It's not, because we're, it's not because we're not familiar with the subject, okay? Not many people are. I know, but no, are. Muslims are familiar with the subject, you okay? You have numerology in... Uh, in uh, no, we don't have numerology in the Quran. All right, there are people who have claimed that, yes. and, we were, and we just discarded it, good, okay? because it's, it's laughable. So, yeah, likewise, it's likewise with the Gamantria, we do not take that as a serious form of study of the scriptures, that's okay? Fine. You're entitled to do that. Okay. But if it was real, you could test it. No, that's the thing. 
first and foremost, you talk about Sola Scriptura. Yes. But Gamancho is a man-made concept. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Well, it's a found thing. We find no, it. No, you don't find it. No, we find Gamancho. No. Gamancho is found in God's Word. No. That's how I became 66 books. No, it, it's not how it became 66 books. Do not go there. It is uh, not how we got listen, into 66 listen, books. Listen, listen, listen. We find Comanche in the 66 books. The number count for the King James Bible only two months ago was seven squared, the number count. Only in the King James and only... Yeah, it, look, it's crazy. That is not something... It, it's, look, first and foremost... Truth in Christ based on channel, what? Based on... No, we find it, we don't create it, because it's no, no. found in 66 books. So no, no, no. If it was done in one book, I'd no, agree. No, 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 no. See, the thing is, the 66 books themselves were chosen by man. It was not chosen by no, God. God we, we, no, God. no. Don't go there. God did not reveal 66 books so to the God Christians. God did not inspire 66. No, no. God did not inspire 66 books. Do you know what God inspired means? Yes, I know. God breathed. Yes, I know that. Okay. Right. But that is not yeah, what happened. Quite, quite because much. the Ethiopian... I know, the fake books. I agree. I attack right. Christianity inside of it. Okay. So you cannot make this claim because the reason you have the books that you have is because of the church uh, canonization. Yeah, but God refines his word. No, I refine you will have, my no. Words. What is the evidence for the inspiration? What is the evidence for the inspiration of these 66 books? The Comanche inside of it and the prophecies. No, 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 no. Now you're inserting. No, you are, you, you, are, you are forcing that into it. No, no, no. The 63,000 um, cross references inside the uh, so 66 what? books. Well, man can't have done that. Man what do you mean? Found that you, uh, you can cross it. You can. Man can't you, have imputed the Gamancha inside of these books. A man can't. Uh, I tell these things before, so you know that I'm God. I'm very into my end time studies as well. So now, no, no, no. are you aware of um, the countries that are attacking Israel with prophesied in Ezekiel 38? No, they're not. Okay. They're well, not because you can test it. Okay. Ezekiel 38. But I've got. Um, Go. Adam, good, yeah, good to see you. You too. Yeah. Good to see you. Um, yeah, well, I mean, we can test these things, man, but I'd, Look. Lo I'd love to give you this. I've only got four. Mm -hmm. I give it, I give it, I'm going to tell you I've given it to, but I've given it to someone you know very close. Yeah. And they look into it and they've had questions. Because you want to know the truth and you're always learning. For, for me, I'll tell you this. I have the truth. Okay. Okay. This is something that I am certain about, and, I, and it's not wavering. No, the Bible now, with says regards to look, the heart sometimes. I agree. I agree that the hearts the heart are hardened. Heart. But the thing is, we know when hearts are hardened yeah. and when hearts are firm on the truth. Mm -hmm. We have a criteria. Okay. Um, with regards to your pam pamphlet, I, I would sincerely say give it to someone else. Not because I'm not interested in what you have to say. If I wasn't interested, I'd just tell you. All right? I'll be very, I'll be very clear. But what I'm saying to you is that I do not take this field of study seriously. Do you take archaeology seriously? Archaeology, I do. Okay. okay. There's the evidence of Lut, Abbe, Mu, Musa. Just, just take a picture of it. So, and if you listen to me, I'll whisper this. If you've got questions afterwards, find me. Yeah, it's no problem. For some reason, I, I, I love Muslims. This is why I do what I do. I'm from Leeds, I love Muslims, that's why I study it, yeah? yeah. When people... I have an issue with my phone, because it's not getting allowed in my reception. Just tell you what, photo, take I'll, ta I'll take this so that I can do that. You can find me privately if you need. No problem. The first one that's but in terms, of, in terms of uh, the... But I will challenge you, uh, challenge you this uh, uh, of now, course. okay? Yeah, I destroyed Hamza with this one, I've destroyed... Muslim no, 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 look, you, 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 can, you can say that. This is Lut, you can, can say... you tell me the story of Lut? No problem. Where was Lut, where was Lut based? Uh, Lut was based in... According to the Qur'an. Oh, I don't and know. And according to the Sunnah. Israel, but you describe it around the Dead Sea, but then you place it somewhere else. Hold on a second, hold on a second. Just tell uh, me the, the story. No, no, to the, to the, no because this is... Because to, to talk about archaeology is to talk about the location as well. Right? Right. So if we are to say... If we are, if we are going to talk about Lut in the Islamic paradigm... I know that. Never okay. Look, we are not given the location of Lut. We are. No, but are you, we're talking about our, my paradigm. Yes, but we can show you ours. But the evidence would be, Allah said they will walk past it day and night and it will leave it as a testament for people not to do those things. So according to Allah, you know where it is. Now you also suppose that they've found it. Some, whoa, whoa, whoa. People do. Some people do, it's laughable when they show me. Okay, now, no we don't because we know where, we, when, we know where the, uh, the nations of Ad and Thamud are because the Prophet Sallallahu when he was traveling through uh, the location, he told the people, this is where they were destroyed and you have to weep when you pass through this area. So you've got okay? a city flipped upside down? No, this, no, I'm talking about a different nation. Okay, okay this is talking, we not are talking Yajuj about the nations, Majuj. no, not Yajuj okay. and Majuj. 
We are talking about the nations of Hud and Saleh. Alayhum salam. Yeah, Hud and Saleh. But the location of Lot, Qawm Lot, that is not given to us. Okay. So to critique it from an archaeological perspective doesn't make sense because we don't even have a location. Okay, so the, the Bibles, can I say about the Bible? Please? You can say about the Bible and you can critique, you can critique the archaeology with reference to the Bible, yes. but you can't do that with the Quran. Because we haven't found it. No, because we haven't been given a location for us to go and search and say whether it's the place or not. Not a problem. Right? So, so um, God said it would rain down brimstone and fire. Direct translation, brimstone, sulfur. Yeah? It's the purest form when we get there. Now in nature, because I attack the Bible, left, right and centre. In nature, we only find 60% pure. And we don't find fishes and volcanoes in that area. We do find it in the north of Israel. And we do find it in the north. Now, God said it was salt the earth. That's where you get the Dead Sea salt from. It was a very luscious land before then. Yeah? So nothing would grow. Now, when you enter that area, at the cities, God's very precise. We enter that area, we don't see any vegetation growing yeah, to this day. When you leave the city, you don't see these sulfur balls. They're 99.7% pure. You can find them. You can go and find them, pull them out and burn them to this day. You can buy them on eBay if you want. How, how deep into the earth do you find them? No, it's on the it's a city. We didn't flip the, flip, flip the thing. The balls like that, then. It's crazy. Well, hold on a second. When we talk about archaeology, yes. we know that throughout the ages, yeah. first and foremost, how, how long ago, biblically now, was what did was lot was lot on the earth? I think it's about three and a half thousand years. All right. So in three and a half thousand years, how many layers of deposit on top of the flip it's city? Not, it's not deposited. Not the, where does stuff come so, through? You believe in a, you believe in the are you whoa, whoa, whoa. Of the, the are earth you, is to the crop? Are you saying that the, the earth doesn't have deposits within it? No, that was to do with the flood. So heavy materials. I'm not, no, no I'm not talking about the flood. I, I, I'm, I'm talking about throughout geek. history. Yeah, but I'm a super geek. So the, the reason we see layers is because when you stir up water, the heavy things it builds layers naturally. This is why we see what we see. No, so but you, no, 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 no. So look, I mean, even in the ice cores, you can you you can date things based on how old they are in the layers of the ground of the earth. It's not accepted in. Um, Courts, the uh, the, courts. This, uh, the courts. So, um, what's that? Carbon dating, which you're trying to refer to, yes? Yes. Carbon dating is not used in courts because you are referring a time span to get those measurements. So we are saying the Earth is this big. Yeah, but that's because it's, because carbon dating. Hold, you, you hold on a second. Because the the the, the reason it's not uh, accepted in courts because carbon dating gives you a range. It's not precise. But I'm not. It can vary in different places. It can vary, right? Massive. Okay. But that's, that's why it's not accepted in course, but we're talking about archaeology. Carbon dated is accepted in the archaeological, in archaeological studies. So, I, I, you know, you're, you're conflating between two fields. Not, not, not the um, carbon dating? Yes, carbon dating is accepted they, in they, they, they that's how it. That's how they date it. Okay. That's so how we know how old things how, are. How long? How old is the Earth? No, uh, 4.5 billion years. You believe that? We've got no... It's 13.3 now, they changed it. The, the no, that's the universe. Now. Oh, the, the universe is 13.7 and, 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 and the Earth is 4.4 and a half. Oh. Right? Um, I, so I have no reason I, I, not to believe that. I, I don't believe that. But the thing is, look. I don't believe that. Fine. But why don't you believe No. I, I, okay. I thought now I can have a I'm a Muslim. <laughs> we, believe, we believe that um, you know, species adapt and stuff yeah, like that. But, can, uh, but from a fish to a human, no. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's just yeah, yeah. stupid. They'll give after their own kind. Have yes. you seen Noah's Ark? Who? Noah's Ark. Have I seen it? Look, there have, been, there have been claims about it being found in Turkey. I neither believe it nor, nor, nor disbelieve it. Okay? Hey, hey. Oh, I've got a channel. I'll speak to you soon. Um, absolutely massive. Oh, yeah. No, no, if you want to speak to them. It's fine. Yeah. So, like I said, you know, I've seen, I've seen what people have said. I mean, Muslims have done this as well. They said, oh, we found... Noah's Ark in Turkey, but and I'm like, same, it, it actually look, lines up with your book as well. But the Bible's more precise. Yeah, same as Moses, yeah, 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 yeah. Listen, but, but me, so me, I don't take it as as uh, solid evidence. What do you take as solid evidence? Okay, no, because at the end of the day, in Islam, we are not given the dimensions of the Ark. Okay, we are not told. We are told I that it the said. Of the earth, to be fair. Okay, we are told that it meant that it was. Um, uh, that is settled on Mount... Um, uh, the, the mountains of Ararat, we say the mountains of, uh, of Ararat. Uh, yeah. I think you say it's another mountain, I've just found... Yeah, I can't name. remember the name of the it's mountain. It's another mountain, it's not the mountain. I can't remember the name of the mountain, but I anyway... I found it the other day. Yeah, but like I said... this the other day. But like I said, you know, there are certain things uh, within archaeology that we do accept. We do be, believe in archaeological uh, evidence, okay? We do that in Islam. What's the best evidence for the Quran? The Quran. The Quran is 
What, what? The evidence of, it, of itself. Can the Bible be the evidence of the Bible itself? No, because it doesn't have a criteria for it to test it. What's the criteria? Okay, so the Quran, the Quran has a criteria to test the Quran. Okay. Right. So that's why it's an evidence of itself. It has. So, for example, it has prophecies. Yeah. Okay. Some of them are false. Uh, no. I'll put them up. Hold okay. On. So none of the um, prophecies is the first one. Secondly, it's the challenges, the falsification tests. And the third is the Are they philosophical uh, the falsification tests? Philosophical falsification tests? Any field. Any, any field. field? Any field. Do you believe in okay, the so um, scientific miracles of the Quran? Well, it depends where, what is the science. Depending on them. Do you think yeah. some of them are fake or they didn't know? Well, I, I believe that some things that the Muslims claim about the Quran to be scientific miracles is, is, not, is incorrect. Okay. okay, that's what I, that's what I said. Okay? So some, like, so for example, you have Muslims that say, oh, the, the, the Quran talks about the Big Bang. That's actually okay? a Catholic... Um, yeah, but, that, right, no, but Muslims say this Catholic. as well, and I'm like, no, okay, because the Big Bang is not a scientific fact, right? It's a theory. Yeah, and, and if you go into science, you have uh, the chaos cannot create order. So yeah. it couldn't have happened from an explosion. Chaos can never come into order, it can only go into more chaos. So it couldn't have... Uh, created what we've seen now. Yeah, well, you so know, that, that, yeah, you can, we can go into that, but, it's, but like I say, in terms of the Quran, the Quran is an evidence of itself because of the challenges it produces and the falsification tests it if produces. If anyone could produce a verse like this, I love this one. Now, this is where... Yeah, in, this is for the Arabs. In, in Matthew, uh, in, in chapters 1 to 11, there's a code, stipulations, of how many vowels can be used. You know, you've heard of uh, Christians with sevens and they talk about the seven. Oh, yeah. Again, this is... Like I said, this field, I've just... No, no worries. Yeah, but not a lot of people know it. I get that. No, it's not that I don't know it. I just don't, don't, trust it. I don't... I don't find any evidence to trust it. To you, take it seriously. You can test it. Hmm? No, but the thing is, uh, first and foremost, first and foremost, it's just, it's a lot of the people... A, there's a stipulation yeah. of 14 times 7. So how many vowels... I know, but you are you speaking about English? Uh, am I speaking about... Yeah, yeah, I'm missing the King James Bible. Right, that's the problem. You can't speak about the Bible and this and this uh, well, and, and these and these patterns. No, but you you won't find this pattern when you trans when you, you when you bring it back to the, the original. Bible. Yes, but that's you're willing, a, the, you're willing there things. But you will in the Greek, the Hebrew, and the King James Bible. No, you won't. I read the New King James Bible. No, but it doesn't you, have the codes in. But I always go to the original. Okay. You you, you have the original of the Quran. Yes. Okay. Uh, how do we know that? Because we, we can trace it. Okay. How do you trace it? It's traced. By, by the oral tradition, by the uh, documentation, by recitation. Of the, uh, Quran means recitation. Doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. So in uh, this is no, no, uh, hold Ibn on. Hamza ran for me, and he's done it before. When I said, "Can you sh you believe Hafs can recite the the um, Quran?" Hafs, yeah, yeah, he's one of the Quran. I, I did a 24-hour live stream the other day. We celebrated the Hafs 100th birthday. I fell asleep for 14, two 14 minute sections. Uh -huh. But the challenge was, and there's money on my channel, if you can find a half to come and be blindfolded and recite it, there's £3,000 on you. What do you mean? So you basically you're asking me to find you a memorizer of the Quran? And I've looked for it, bro. This is what I do. I always test it. No, no, but... If you can... Every Ramadan, days. every Ramadan... I know, over 30 days, and then they have people that correct it. No, we have people that go that recite the entirety of the Quran. So it's people, it's not person. And it's not one guy. Yeah, obviously, because you need to take breaks, you need to rotate. Why do you need to rotate? But a man can do this thing. It's, it's no, easily look, possible. The, 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 the memorizers of the Quran, they do it on their own. They, memorize, they recite the whole Quran on their own. We even have their recordings. Yeah, I know, but you don't see it vis visually. Anyone can read oh, you it. Know, you, you I know, you see it visually as well. No, no, no. I, I, I've looked at these ones. Honestly, honestly I have. You'll see, you'll see someone doing it and then the verses coming up with really nice YouTube videos. I listen look, to them, so I learn. This is, English, look, I'm not even going to argue this because this is a, an undisputed fact. That there are millions upon millions of Muslims that have memorized. Why? If you had a son and he was a hafiz, no, no, no. But, this. but this is but the, reciting the Quran is not a. It's not an exercise to prove anything. It is worship. So we're not gonna we're not gonna come onto your channel and recite it just just because you asked for. That's not the purpose of the Quran. We don't we take the Quran seriously. It's not it's not something to be used as a gimmick to prove something. Two seconds. Let me just keep... I'll be back in 30 seconds. No problem. Ugh, oh, final Fair enough, Chef. That's all right. I just gave him... Um, 
Yeah. So we don't. We could actually do the same thing if we had um, over 30 days. We could get people up to recite the Bible. Yeah. Uh, no one can recite the Bible by heart. No, we, no, no, we've got the whole thing. It's three times, five times bigger than yours. It's 32,000 verses. Yours is 5,000 something. Yeah. So we we could actually do it for multiple people coming up. We could do it. I would be terrible. I smash scripture. Yeah, but what? Why? The call is terrible. What is the purpose? What is the benefit of using this time? We, we, we are Muslims, so we... We the benefit of mentioning that you have Hafiz. What do you if you mean? have a Hafiz, wouldn't they want to prove it? No, so the, be the benefit... Bit, so the benefit... The benefit of being a Hafiz is that you carry the Qur'an with you at all times. Yeah, I've got most of the Bible in my head and okay. I carry it. No, but we carry it with us in our hearts and our minds. Yeah, I carry because, it. Okay, so, okay, the because, okay, so... Jesus is the word. So, so the, more we, the more we memorize, okay, there are benefits to it, okay? Uh, it loosens the tongue, okay? We have, a, oh, first and foremost, you know, the fact that we are connected to Allah all the time, okay? How are you connected to Allah all the time with the scripture? Because it's His words, uh, uh, verbatim. Through the, through the words you're connected to Him? Yeah, and our actions, our worship, because every time we recite His words, you, every time we remember Him, every words, time we do good things, this is our connection to Him, this is our his worship. Are words the same words as in the Torah and the Injil? Do you have those? What, the, to the original? Are you talking about the original the, Torah? The original, yeah. the original Torah and Injil, we don't know. So you lost those words? No, the Jews and the Christians lost those. Did they, how we didn't the lose them. How can the Jews and Christians agree to lose them? So, they, uh, the, so they didn't agree. To, cha to change scripture, Jew Jews and Christians, we pray for them, we love them, but they are, they're made enemies of the gospel for our benefit. So the Jews and the Christians, they, so how can we the, change Jews, the, words? the Jews and the Christians, what they have done throughout history is uh, disobey God. And change and change his words. Okay. No, to the degree where they 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 disbelieve. They have disbelieved in their prophets, uh, in his prophets, and they've disbelieved in him. They've associated partners with him, and they've changed the scripture. So These are grave things. We're not talking about simple they were things. They kicked out of Israel for it, according to the Quran, and in the, we're living in the end times, aren't we? Yes. Okay. So uh, it said that uh, in the end times the Jews will come back to their land. Yeah, which the, in the Quran verses it says the land was given to them. It said they'll come no, back no, to it, but they should turn back from fighting from it. Okay, so well, I think you're referring to chapter 17. I, I, okay, I so verses, so chapter 17 where it mentions that they, doesn't say about them coming back to their land. It, it mentions that they will be uh, given power again. And, is it? Yeah, second I think time. It might be 21 actually. Okay, so second time. There will be a second time. I don't know what verse you're referring to, but uh, I think based on what you're saying about the children of Israel. We pray uh, for everyone, bro. Virtually, and look, never look into we, the eyes of we, we, we ask God, we ask Allah to to guide mankind. But at the end of the but day, Allah will Allah will uh, deceive who He wants. Uh, no, there's not that verse for that one. No, you sure? Okay, I, I thought I read it the other day. No, there's no such verse that says okay. that. Okay. How long have you been uh, uh, Muslim studying? Um, uh, studying, I've been studying Islam since 2015. So nine years, coming on ten. Um, I'd love to have you on my channel. I'm a nice guy, bro. Oh, oh you seem low. Yeah, yeah, I, I've, no, I've no doubt that you're a nice guy. Believe people, me, if, if I thought that you had a, a, a hostile agenda, I'd treat you in a different nice. way. Some people, when they lie, they trust the words, the money grafting. There's yeah. loads of people that I... I go yeah. for the heads of people that are educated yeah. and are lying and twisting words. Yeah. Well, listen, I'm not going to promise anything because there are brothers they that I... They tell me that I'm a troll. No, it's not about that. It's not about a troll. I judge it for myself. Yeah, like uh, there are there are people that other du'at won't speak to, and I speak to them, right? So, however, the reason I won't promise anything is because there are many people that get in contact with me that ask me for my time, and I don't want to start promising people no, when no. I've already got so much the on my plate. Bible says, "Let your yes be yes and your no be no." Yes. Who knows what's going to happen? For exactly. So, if Allah wills, we'll we'll. Inshallah. Yes, exactly. Inshallah. Okay. Uh, a quick one. I oh, know, Joe. What? I'm not going to discuss this on camera. Uh, is it a Cov FF channel? Yes. Trying to dock someone and get them killed in, a, in an unsafe country. I was meant to debate with Aladdin. Raw Muslim pulled out yesterday. Who is it that he docks? We're not going to mention the names on the screen because cameras are recording. All right, let's come off camera because uh, we're done here anyway. So let me just. Yeah. Uh, does, I don't know who's.